Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm good in yourself. I'm fine and welcome to Happy People News. Thank you. I'm so glad you're early. It's lovely. It's nice working with people who keep time. <laughs> are you always like this? Okay. That's yes, great. I am. That's a good trait, especially for a person in business. So, Ongile, okay, tell me you. about yourself. What do you do? Um, what is your business? Um, so my name is Umpile Kilemihile Ditabo. Mm -hmm. I am 17 years old. I own a art business. 17 years I'm old. Painful. Wow, yes, you're I a baby. Am. Okay, yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. So the name of my company is Le Art. Right. And I started doing my work last year while mm -hmm. I was doing my trick. Mm -hmm. Um. I never thought I would get this far. I never thought that my work would impact so many people in the way that it did. Really? And I never thought I'd be given this platform. Mm. I am very grateful for this platform, by the way. You are most welcome. And I, to have you. Mm? I am honestly a firecracker. I describe myself as a very outgoing person. I have mm. way more talent than just painting. I'm mm. a dancer. I'm a mom. Really? Um, yes, I am. Multi-talented. Uh -huh. multi-talented mm -hmm. and I'm not just a pretty face I'm also smart you can tell by I already have a business at the age of 17 of course you are not a pot plant <laughs> no I'm not no definitely <laughs> not <laughs> wow 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 so what is your um, art business what does it involve do you paint do you illustrate what type of art do you do um, I at the moment I'm doing um, acrylic art. All right. I paint. Uh -huh. I use um, acrylic liquid, which is a form of paint which allows your artwork to flow in a way that you can't paint. It's mm. really beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I I'm honestly branching myself out right mm -hmm. now. I'm using I'm in the process of using clay. Mm -hmm. I want to sculpt. I want to use all forms of artwork into my art, honestly. Just, I don't want to be a one trick pony when it comes to mm -hmm. art. I want to explore all forms of art. Mm -hmm. I also use water, watercolor paints as mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. So I will be going to oil paintings. Mm -hmm. All right. So currently, it's um, more um, contemporary art using acrylics. And what would you say? What type of um, art do you depict? Is it landscape? Is it portrait? Or is it um, abstract? I also, by the way, I'm an artist myself. I studied art in school. Yeah, yeah so I can relate. Awesome. I can relate. And I did everything, the ceramics, the fine art, everything, Maybe. printmaking. It's good to know all the types and disciplines of art. And then I studied history of art. So do you, are you studying art at school as well? No, I'm a self-taught artist. Really? I will be going to school next year for graphic design. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So I don't know much about art as I should, but mm -hmm. I'm learning as I go. But then yes. graphics graphics may not be, if you're wanting to pursue fine art, um, do you want to pursue fine art or you prefer graphics? Is that what you're saying? You're not sure. Um, I wanted to do fine arts mm -hmm. and last year. Mm -hmm. wanted to do it this year but due to spaces and everything I couldn't really go to school so I decided to why not make my art digital since mm -hmm. everything is going digital these days. Mm -hmm. so I'm playing both sides of the ball honestly mm -hmm. I, I would I would recommend that you try both don't limit yourself so in other words you could do the graphics which I'm also a graphic designer by the way qualified um but i would recommend that you don't stop your art you know maybe do art classes and maybe also get the theory you know of art history because it, it is so fascinating and it gives you so much so much depth now i'm giving you advice instead of interviewing you <laughs> <laughs> I love it. but this is so close to my heart and you are so precious and i want to ensure and help that help you and ensure that you follow the right path you know so, so, so I would say if you can do both, you know, continue with your art, you know, part time until there's an opening. Because I mean, really, you should be able to get into an art school, a university like yes. a Michaelis, UCT, or uh, any institution around the country. But I will speak to, I will shop around for you. 
And then, so currently you'll be, you are actually selling your art pieces, right? Yes, you, I am. And then, and then what, I know you said acrylic. Do you have a specific type of um, painting or um, medium? I know the medium, but do you have a preference when it comes to art? Is it people that you like to draw or paint? Or is it still, still life? You know what still life is? Like it can just be, yes, I do. you know. Ne? So what out of those types and forms of, what is the composition of your art? What does it entail? You know what composition is? Ne? To be honest, mm -hmm. yeah. to be mm -hmm. honest, my art is really everywhere. I touch every place. I touch right. por portraits. Right. I'm currently doing a portrait for a friend of mine. Right. Um, I I sold a piece of still life as well. Mm -hmm. Um, but my favorite has to be abstract art. It, it honestly has to be mm -hmm. abstract art. Mm -hmm. It has so many different types of meanings it mm -hmm. it touches people in different ways as you know beauty is mm -hmm. in the eye of the beholder of course so i love to hear what people have to say about my art how it makes them feel mm -hmm. it's i i like to tell myself that it's not about what i feel when i paint the painting right. it's about how people perceive it exactly. how people receive it how yeah. they interact with it how they react to it yes that's yes <laughs> So I would imagine, okay, now that leads to my next question. What makes Umphile happy? What makes Umphile happy? Yes. Wow, that, that is a difficult but yet easy question, to be mm. honest. Mm. What makes me happy is just painting. Mm. Not always, mm. because it's, it's really overrated to say that painting makes me happy, because mm. at times I paint and be frustrated because mm. I'm, I'm only human, I do make mistakes. Yeah. But when I just zone out into my work mm. and just paint from pure of heart, mm. dancing also makes me happy, to be honest. Mm. When I put on my earphones, imagine mm. myself on a stage performing. Mm. It just makes me happy. And just being around people, my closest people. Mm. I'm an introvert, extrovert. So mm. being around my family, it's just incredible. Mm, amazing oh wow i can't wait to see your work so where can we find your pieces i have an instagram page right um it's la art 2 le dot art 2 mm -hmm. and on saturday we have a market that i will be attending and you will see my pieces there mm -hmm. it's in mabopani mm -hmm. it's at a large roundabout between Block C and Block B. That's awesome. And then, with regards to maybe you know, some people want to know. They think art, and they think, oh, expensive. Um, how do you do your pricing? Do you work within a person's budget, or you've got set prices? I have set prices, but they mm. are very low because I am still starting. All right, and establishing your name and stuff. All right, I understand. Yes. And then another thing, I'd like. I, I, mm -hmm. Yeah. You were saying? No, you can, you can talk. Oh, gosh. Now I forgot. Talk. You continue. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was saying I don't want people to really stretch their arms when they buy my pieces because mm. I'm selling the name. I don't do it for the money, All right. to be honest. All right. The brand and the name. Spread. Mm. You're building the brand. Oh, yeah. What I wanted to ask you is now, you know, and there's, there's another thing whereby a person would say, Ombile, I want you to do a drawing or a painting of my son or my pet or my, you know, whatever. Um, do you also, would you, are you open to being commissioned? Where a person says, I yes. commission you to do this, do that. This is my budget. You're open to that. And then, you yes, know, there's also corporates could also want your work, you know, whereby corporate says for our interior, we're wanting some art pieces. You know, the sky's the limit. You're open to that as well? Oh, I am, wow. definitely. That's exciting. I, I, I strongly, I strongly um, want to recommend that you don't focus solely on graphics. If art is your thing and you find joy, just do the art, do the fine art. It's nice to have the graphic design skill. By the way, this is one of my art pieces from 
tertiary. <laughs> it's an abstract. It's long yeah, long yeah, it's a long time ago. So I've I haven't been looking at it. Huh? What's it? I've been I've been looking at it. It's, it's you? Yeah, I did this like about geez, like 20 years ago, if not more, more than 20 really? years ago. And I stopped. So it's you know, art you have to practice. You can't. It's having a talent, you have to practice, fine tune it, you know, this is why we have to go to school and, you know, to perfect our talents and skills. Yeah. Anyway, so I look forward to seeing you um, and meeting you officially at the market yes. on Saturday. Okay. I will be so glad. I'm the great, great. And then you don't have a, like an example of a piece to show us somewhere that you can grab quickly? Mm -hmm. Let me quickly grab a piece that I've done with Clay. It was my first time working with Clay. Please. So I want to. Please. Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> can get it. Sure. So this is the piece. Mm -hmm. There's light. Wow. So it's kind of. Wow. I can see the texture. It is beautiful. And then do you um, put it in a kiln after creating it? You know what a kiln is? Sorry. Like an, did you put it in a kiln, like an oven, after creating? Oh no, you didn't. Oh, okay, but it looks. I so just. Put it, uh, that's amazing. I that's, just put it out to burn. It's got like a shiny texture. That's just so beautiful. Metallic texture. Yes. How did you get that? It's paint. I used metallic paint. Oh, metallic paint. It's so unique, man. So you've got more of those. Thank you. And that's, I'd say that's this what makes you first one. your first one. Wow, that that is going to be a hit. If you continue with that and make it a series, maybe different styles in that format. Wow, it's going to make you stand out definitely. You. And that le, your brand will definitely stand out. Do you have your signature on the painting as well? Not as yet, but I'm going to put it. Yeah, so people know sensitive. that it's your, your work. Okay. Thank you so yes. much. Have a lovely day. Thank you. See you Saturday. Thank you. Right. Bye. Bye.